of day four here in Pozo for the Gran Canaria PWA Windsurfing World Cup. And what a day it's been. We have a result in the women's elimination. In fourth place, Justina Schnaddy went toe to toe with Sarah Keita Offringer, but Offringer started that heat so well and held the lead to the end, and she secures the third spot. In the final, it was a familiar matchup. Ibaya Moreno going against Dida Moreno. Dida Moreno had already beat Sarah Keita in the semi final, but she had to take down Ibaya. Could she do it? Ibaya has only beaten Dida once in the past 24 years. But today was her day. Hibaya Moreno took down the final, had good jumping, good wave riding, and she secures the win in the single elimination. <laughs> it's uh, amazing, <laughs> really amazing feeling. Uh, we've been training very hard the last two years. And with these hard conditions, it's really a, kind of a lottery who pass because their level is so high. So we're really stoked to be in the final against uh, each other yeah. and yeah, congrats to the other girls as well. They sail amazing and just really happy. <laughs> it's a dream come true. <laughs> Who's going to win? Um, <laughs> each other, it doesn't Wait, matter. I don't care anymore. This, that was a final before. <laughs> Semi-finals was a final and now I just go out and enjoy. So with the results secured in the women's elimination, it was on to the men and we got through a fair few heats but stopped early in the second round. Standout has to be Liam Dunkerbeck. Yes, Bjorn Dunkerbeck's son has been on a charge and delivered a pretty tasty looking heat today. Japanese rider Takuma Sugi also stood out as well as Josef Pons and Marsilio Brown. We will have to come back tomorrow though, so let's see how the weather pans out. Will we finish that single elimination? The conditions at the moment don't look perfect, but with a pushing tide and a little bit of luck, we should finish. So join us tomorrow for more action on the Pedal Way Tour.